This is the end. This is the end. Well, technically, this is the end, but, you know, the, the feng shui of this place is awful. That's better. No, seriously, this is the end. Last episode of the season. So if we're going to do anything with this temple, we need to do it today. But first, I thought I'd take you on a little tour of where we've been this season. It all began over here behind this tree. That's right, this is the tree where we began our journey into the inner realms. We met everybody out here in front of the gate of the shopping district and we got a tour all through this lovely server. But unfortunately, we didn't have a place to call our own and so, so we shacked up here. Ow. in this fantastic flat. That's right, we took this empty room here, penthouse suite, on the top of the Babel Hotel, and we turned it into our own little slice of paradise. In fact, Cubsy liked it so much, he invited us to clean up some of the other rooms in the hotel, like the invisible suite. Excuse me, I'm taking a bath, and the King Arthur suite. Complete with flushable toilet. Gotta love it. That's right, if you get the world download, you too can flush yourself. But that wasn't all we did. We also ran for office. In fact, I'm not sure if I ever got the position. Nevertheless, we went and cleaned the place up, making the entrance to the shopping district absolutely gorgeous. We even made a new dock area down here at the base of the hotel. Looking rather pretty. Nothing like swimming with the squids in the sunset. Unfortunately, we never got around to fixing this puddle over here by the south gate. Actually, Let's do that now. And just like that, the south entrance is looking good. Went for a little bit of nature here, bringing in some dark oak, and I like it. I love the way the leaves cover over the pathway, but there's just a little bit of light shining in, and I continued the theme that had already been set up out here and brought it right into the shopping district. Check it out out looking good now outside the gate here it's um yeah yeah it's still a swamp but at least the shopping district is the place to be so there you go got a nice little path through here so hmm what was the next thing we did this season and of course the answer to that is that we came out here and began the process of ruining this jungle Ruin? We, we ruined the... We ruined the ruin. That's what we did. Uh-huh. That's what we did. And if we look down below here, not only did we ruin it, but we cleared it out. So we've got this massive space in here, and I promised you before this season was over, we would do something with this space. And now is that time. And this is that place. That's right, behind me there is a minecart. And inside of this temple, inside everything under this temple, there is a fabulous, fabulous roller coaster. Now I have to apologize, this video is probably coming out a little later than expected, but you know... You can't rush art. And I also have to give a big shout out to Minor Thoughts and Reimagined who came over here and helped me out with some of the decoration down below. I'll show you that in just a second. But I think it's time to get in the minecart and go for a ride. Now, let's be honest. I'm pretty sure going for a ride in a minecart isn't going to feel the same as it does if you're going on for a ride on the minecart. So I do encourage you all to get the world down low when the season ends and go for the ride of your life. So here we go. We Ooh, look at the waterfall and we're coming around here getting disoriented in the dark, but we're going up and they're headed. Oh, straight into lava. But we're okay. 
And we're coming up over this hill. I'm hoping the owls are out. No owls yet. I'll have to show you that in a minute. And coming around. Ah! Jump scare. Here's some temple ruins. And we come out into the big room. There's the idol. The lava stream. And oh! This guy's running away. And this guy doesn't look so good. Hmm. Okay, where are we going now? Coming around. Ah! It's like a dead tree in the dark, and we're back into the dark again. A little disoriented. Where are we coming out? We're coming out... <gasps> right here. Yep. Yep. That's the ride. Puts us right back on the ground, and if we need another cart, we can just reach in and grab it. What do you think? Let me know in the comments what you think of the ride. I can't wait to see the other Inner Realmers come over here and try it out for themselves. And I can't wait for you to have the chance to ride this yourself in the coming world download when the season is finally over. Now, I know all that went by a little quickly, so let me walk you through this coaster. I figure this way you can see some of the details on the video and really get to enjoy the look of what's going on here. We've got sort of a mine shaft experience as we come in, but as we get to the first drop, it suddenly goes dark and so we come down here we've got this dimly lit waterfall coming down in the background but suddenly we are cast utterly into the darkness i can't even see where i am okay there i am and what this does is it sort of disorients you you go around a couple curves here and we come over to a little drop and then this is the big pull to get you up to the full height of the roller coaster and actually if you're right here i think you can glance over you just see a hint of something that's coming later um, that's true up here at the top as well you can see down everywhere in this big main room from up here but you're too busy focused on the fact you are about to jump in lava but of course you don't you come down here and you're perfectly safe caught on the track where you are spun around and you get taken up here to one of my favorite spots this back corner Oh, and there's a skeleton. These guys are not supposed to spawn in here. Yeah. Die. Die, I say. Uh, literally, there is string on everything. Now, did you see that? The, the eyes appear and disappear in this corner back here. Uh, and I love this. It looks like the temple has been uh, just fallen away. And you can see the night sky outside. There's the moon. But every once in a while, the eyes come on. And they are on a... I don't know if you can hear it. Um, sorry, I just heard a skeleton again. I don't know where they're coming from because this is all slabbed. Hmm. Let me put a little light in here so we can see what we're looking at. See, I've got string down. It's all slabbed. There's no reason there should have been a skeleton in here. But anyhow, I don't know if you can hear it. Let's see. Let's listen. Listen. Nope, I'm, I'm not hearing it. That skeleton is out. The skeleton you're hearing now is is outside. Oh, there, there was. There's a chicken back there. And every time that chicken steps on a pressure plate, that's when the eyes appear. Okay, so that brings us to this bend. So you come up and over this hill. You get to see the night sky. And then you come down into this ditch. And it won't work right now because we're not on a minecart. But as you come over here, this is where Miner has put in. There's this empty cave on the side. Miner has put in this lovely little jump scare where these two guys right here hop up and I wish I could see their faces. Those two guys hop up and tell you you're going the wrong way. Come over another hill and we are into the jungle ruins. This is you can actually see outside here. See, look at this. Where are these guys coming from? I have spent hours spawning this place, spawn proofing this place, and they are still showing up actually he might be coming in from outside this is our little secret entrance here uh, this is the back of everything like you really want to see that yeah he might just come in from out here so let's uh, I have nothing I have no blocks hmm okay we're gonna just uh, ignore that and come back here onto the ride so here are the temple ruins and that takes you down here and up where we see this sign this is danger Falling rocks, and that's important because we're about to come into the big main room uh, where we, the first thing we see is this villager idol, obviously something that the original Minecraft jungle 
dwellers worshipped. And we come around, we get the, another glimpse of the lava. And here's the money piece, folks. Here is the money piece. This is Reimagine's armor stand work. Uh, she's got the stalactite. Might. Always get that wrong. Fallen down and just impaling this poor innocent traveler. I don't think they're innocent travelers. I think they were down here for the emeralds. Uh, this guy takes one look at his friend and he is straight out of here. Uh, even dropping a little bit of his hard, cold hard cash behind. Uh, which brings us over here. We get to spin around the lava once more. And we come through this little uh, desecrated bookshelf area as if there was a building here once. And it brings us out into the outside. Oh, there's a cobweb. I always forget when the... Doesn't catch you when you're in the cart, but it catches you when you're walking through. Comes into this very dark area. You can just make out the outline of a dead tree here. But as you go by, each of these little guys shoots arrows at you one after the other. Even some chains hanging from the ceiling. See, this little you can see up there into where you first came out and went into the lava. Uh, but then the ride takes you down and it drops you the final time. It drops you, bam, into this tunnel. Again, completely dark and disorienting. And once you come around here, it shoots you straight into this water stream and you are out and the ride is over. So again, what do you think? Uh, what would you add to this ride? What would you take away? Uh, is it uh, too long, too short? You leave me your thoughts in the comments. And right now, what we need to do is we've got a couple more things before the season is over. And the first one involves heading over to the shopping district. As we come out of the portal, there should be a brand new building out here. There it is. Let's see, where is the entrance to this building? This is the memory building. This is the building where we... Uh, are going to leave reminders of everything that happened this season. We've got the heads of all the players here that you can come and take a look at. We've got some of the events and characters that took place early on this season. Uh, look, we even made it up there. We're one of the last. We came right before Elaney at the end. And then right over here is where we are going to leave our memory. So give me a second. Let me do some work and I'll be right back. And just like that, we have left our mark here among the memories of the season. I've put together a little little mashup here, a little mashup between uh, the jungle temple and you could just see, you could just see the villager idol in there. See, see the eyebrow up there in the eyes. There's that big old nose. And of course, we've got the minecart going round and round here, uh, just so everybody knows this is an invitation to come out and ride the coaster. Even brought our little parrot out here to have a place to stay and people to keep him company until next season. So that's about it. We need to do a couple more things back at the base, and then we'll be ready to head into season two. Just need to put a few last things away so that you can get at them. Need to make sure there's nothing in my inner chest because... Nope, there's nothing in my inner chest. Because everything in my inventory, I'm going to take over and bury beneath the dead tree in the roller coaster. So if you want to get all my stuff, my armor and my elytra, and I don't know if you really want any of this. But if you do, it'll be buried over under the dead tree in the roller coaster. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, this is the end. This is the end. This is the end. This, this is, is the end. end. See you in season two.